in what is China's biggest case of wrongdoing, the disgraced politician Bo Shi Lai is now officially charged with corruption, embezzlement, and abuse of power. But his trial date has not been announced. Last spring, his wife Gu Kai Lai received a suspended death sentence for murdering a British businessman late last year. But it's not all bad news for the Bo family. Their son Bo Gua Gua is in the U.S. and starting a new chapter in his life. Here's Link Asia's Natalie Ornell. China's netizens can't stop talking about Prince Link Bo Gua Gua. The 25-year-old, educated at Oxford and Harvard, will soon start law school at Columbia University. Beijing-based journalist Vincent Ni revealed a Twitter screenshot of a directory at Columbia Law this week. It confirmed Bo Gua Gua as a newly registered student. Interestingly, Columbia quickly deleted the entry. On Renren, China's equivalent of Facebook, one user sarcastically commented, I suppose that Bo Gua Gua's law school personal statement must be a lengthy composition to move people and make them cry. A Weibo user chimed in, from the UK's Harrow School to Oxford University to Harvard University, Bua Gua Gua's tuition is always what Chinese internet users question the most. Chinese internet users widely suspect the Bua family fortune had to have come from illegal and corrupt activities. Indeed, one user asked, Bua Gua Gua is going to be a first year at New York's Columbia Law School, the alma mater of two President Roosevelt's, Tuition costs 60000 per year in addition to 20000 for living expenses. Who's going to pay for it? Did he earn it? But others said to forget the money. Why do we only care about Bo Gua Gua's tuition expenses, but not how hard he worked to achieve his success? Parents should not let us see him in the wrong lens. I hope he will become very successful and serve his country well. Gua Gua, whose name means melon melon, a fruit symbolic of family unity in China, won't be united with his family anytime soon. By studying law, however, he will be following in his mother's footsteps. She was a high-flying lawyer until she decided she was above the law. For Link Asia, I'm Natalie Ornell. Airwaves, a global channel of uncompromising stories. World news, documentaries, entertainment, and culture. Link TV, connecting you to the world. For more information, visit linktv.org.